Today's Captain's Blog is made possible by a grant from Patrick Lovell. Hello guys, welcome to today's Captain's Blog. I don't have my damn watch on. It's... It's 13.04 on Tuesday, February 7th, 2017, and nobody's here. <laughs> There's a generator here, which is kind of cute. I wonder what's going on with this. Huh. Well, that's one way to do it, isn't it? <laughs> We're just going to put a big hole through the gas tank so that you can get to the thing. I got a question for you guys. You might be able to help out. So that is a 2003 Mitsubishi Eclipse GTS, GST, I think it's GTS. Um, these are a set of aftermarket taillights for it. I got a set of replacement headlights as kind of an upgrade. Now, here is the exact label on the headlight. Okay, you now have the data. Focus, you fuck. There. You have the data. All right, here's what the, well that isn't much help. Let's look at this one. They're the same. So here on the back, there is this number. Okay, there's that number. There's this number here. And there's this number here. this number here. Those numbers are right next to the bulb socket so I'm hoping they might be significant. Look at the shape of that socket. Look at the shape of that socket. Now, can you find me bulb sockets that fit these damn things? Because we can't. Batman and I have adventured to all of the auto stores in town and we've been to the special import part auto store and oh my god I can't get any. Also it would be really useful if I could figure out a better way to align these headlights. There's only one screw adjustment and it only does up and down and these I still can't get them quite right for up and down and I certainly can't get them right for in and out and any help on that would be appreciated. Also please send me inf any information on what the proper aiming target setup thing is, because we've just been using the garage door and it's still too damn low. I gotta tweak that again today. But if, is there like some official template system mojo, a set of standards that probably involves like a Sharpie and a tape measure and a white wall for properly aligning headlights because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. And I'm really interested in any advice you have because everybody I talk to is, all right, just point them at a garage door, man. And just, Make them look right. And just teach me what I'm doing here, because I don't know what the hell I'm doing here, and I could use your help. <sighs> Hi. Hi. What's up today? Your your plant has diverged. That's why I asked for a stick. You need a stick? I got a stick. You got a stick. You got a stick, and your plant has still diverged. Now I need some string. Or a, just a zip tie. Oh, that's a much more appropriate stuff. I wonder how many things you're killing by stabbing that in there. Okay. Now I need a string. So what's up today? I'm writing. You're writing? He's writing? Jerry's been... You're here? It's going to be okay? The dog's here? It's getting better by the minute. Jerry has been cleaning. It's better. Okay. And he's been on a mission to update all of our paperwork with our new branding. Cool. Um, Exciting stuff. We've been getting waivers organized. Okay. And that's Lotus, new person. Hi. She's organizing. Okay. And Em's here. Em's here. What are you doing? Grant stuff. Grant stuff. Oh, wow. Well, you're doing grant stuff. Okay. It's serious business. We should get another laptop out on display. 
dog is tormenting the open door student. Hi. <laughs> we'll be back. I still haven't seen Batman. Or, I know Bruce is here too. They're at Home Depot. Home Depot. Okay, we'll be back. Time is 1752. This is Matt. How's it going, guys? What you doing, Matt? Tell them what you got going on here. I am working on, right now, I'm working on an end grain cutting board. So I'm just slapping together a whole bunch of uh, 7 8 size pieces of wood. Why seven eighths? Because that's what I could make happen with all the scrap I had. Oh, okay. There's no, that was just the standard size I made them all. So what's going to happen, we'll just grab a handful of these. So when it's all done, I'm going to stagger like that. And I'm going to cut them probably an inch and a quarter thick into strips. And then I'll glue it all together again. And that will be the final design. It'll look like a oh. small checkerboard. You're one of the cool kids. Cool kids. I just want to be a cool kid. Come here for a big hug. Oh, you're looking sexy. Chris, you look like you need a shower. <laughs> Chasing after the. You the look like snake. a cat that just came out of a burned down barn. <laughs> <laughs> that is a lot of truth to that. So you having fun? You look like you're having all kinds of fun. Oh, all the awesome. Yeah. And isn't. This is the glamour and glory of working at the Geek Group. Exactly. You should get him in on some of that. Nah, he's, he's wearing he's white. Too white he wants that. to be helping. Oh, totally. I can feel it. <laughs> oh, check my Facebook. I just wrote, like, I don't know, giant six page post and put a video up, and you should check that out on my Facebook. Have you commented about the lights yet? I haven't seen it yet. I need to know about that. It's freaking me out. I need some help. It's Tuesday Night Family Group here doing their thing. And I'll be back. I gotta talk to Moose and the music's on in here, so you have fun. Wow, this is a really easy one to wire to. Alright, show me the plug so we can get a picture of that. Time is 1808. And this is the plug. Let me. Focus! 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 There you go. Okay, so that's the plug in the boat. Batman, you had a piece of paper with information on it. Yeah. All right, so that's a plug. Is that that's the engine side of the plug? Yeah, that, that is so our exact make and year of model. This is the make and year and model of the yeah. boat, Just of, the of this engine in this boat. So basically, what he told me today is if we can just get this with the wires that are about this short off of it, uh -huh. you just run them. Each one will be labeled. It'll okay. be less than, way less than three fifty. <laughs> Yeah, but if I could get the actual harness, it'll yeah. have that plug on it, and yeah. all the wires cut to length to where they go with the right termination on them, and everything's the right colors, and it's all just fucking Perfect. ducky. Yeah, and I don't mind paying a couple hundred bucks yeah. for that, because I know the pain if, if you, is worth if way gotta, more than a couple hundred bucks if you don't. If we got to get different gauges of marine wire... It's, yeah, it, it, that it, shit it, gets it, really it, expensive it, in a hurry. And what I don't want to do is end up with the cluster fucky bullshit that is this, where there's marine wire, there's car wire, there's bits of speaker wire yeah. in here. Yeah. Not used for what used to be speakers. There's so some sketchy, shady, nasty shit happening in here. Hot. Yeah, but this right here looks like it's the sub cable that they replaced. Yeah, Probably. It's, it's junk. It runs, the motor is good, but... I mean, he's got stuff jumped into each other. Yeah, it's and you'll see wires that change color five times in three feet. And just nope, so nope, this looks nope. Like it's a pretty basic one. I got yeah, it's rock simple. We, if I had the harness, I could rewire this whole thing in like two hours, yeah. if that. All right, I'm going up there again this week, and I'm gonna bring him these pictures. All right. Because he's kind of show him cool. pictures of this area. This I think is fucked up in some way, and I don't, I don't know enough to know what's wrong, but I know this arrangement here looks a lot like this, and I don't know what the hell's going on. I don't know if this was this was replaced with this it or this like broke it, and it's or the same. or what they're they're very similar but they're not 100% the same. Yeah. This big plate doesn't exist here. So I don't know I don't know what's going on. I don't know shit about shit, but I know that they those one of these things is kind of like the other. 
but one of these things does not belong. So this looks yeah, like it's just a newer, better model of it. That's what I'm hoping. But I just I want to get the like wiring here, sorted out, bolts on and, and to bolt then we'll there. go through this and do like a full fluids change and just make sure she's scook them. Well, I wanted to maybe change the I alternator. You want it and I owe you for it, so all right. I do appreciate you guys letting me through that car here. So well, yeah, I'm now happy that I got help. the pictures, I think it'll be pretty easy. Cool, because I wanted I got to do this quick. This is a time sensitive thing. Yep. Like okay. I said, I'm going back out there this week. All right. Oh, you know what I want. If I could have the part for this by this weekend, I'd be thrilled. Thing is, what he was saying is they discontinued this motor. Okay. And so what he's finding is a harness that will fit to this motor. Okay. Yeah. So it won't. It might not look identical, but it'll have all the plugs. Well, let's need. do the best we yeah. can with what we got. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. And if any of you out there can find me the harness for this motor, I would be very appreciative. Um, so is this? We've got a distributor, yep. and we've got a coil, so what kind of ignition system is this? Because there's like a point system, an electronic system, and another system. What was his options? I'll tell you what he said that they came in. Take lots of pictures so he can figure it out. And I'm sure one of my commenters will be able to allow that. Pointer digital electro electrical. That ain't good. Um, That's what he said. Points or digital electric? I don't see a box anywhere yeah, that's, for so that's why he's digital. Point. It's right on the year that they started switching them over. Okay. Where would we see a points it would system? Be like like right on a motorcycle, here. I know how that works, but on, on one like this, here? I don't know. It'd be it'd be on the <laughs> distributor. Yeah. So I'm gonna get some really good up close shots yeah. of the distributor, and one of my guys on the internet will be able to tell me stuff. Um, I'm also going to get a shot down here of okay. that. Tag. Yeah, I don't know if they can see it, but I'm going to hold the camera here and hope it focuses Just on the Just take a picture thing. of this because this is on there. Uh, hold on, put a number on that. Huh? Here. I don't know, will that pick up my phone? Maybe, what do you got? I got the picture of it. You have a picture of the tag? Yeah. Okay, the number on the tag is F552644. F552644. So that's the thing on the tag down there on the engine. Here. So maybe maybe one of my awesome viewers can figure it out. And all that is what that yeah, I got I got a shot of that for the blog, so they got that. Wow, I gotta put a new floor back there. That's that's fucked. It's gonna be alright. It's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Oh. It's trip, isn't it? I bet you can see you coming a mile away. Oh, that's kind of the point. It's practically stealth. It's very subtle, it's very low key, it's very dignified. But this is last month's project. That's the next one. I gotta get that done because global war it's raining today. It's February 7th, and it's raining because global warming is a lie. And that's gonna be in the water soon, and I need the motor yeah. Okay. Thank you, sir. Not a problem. Is there anything else you need anything I can no, help you with? Talk, talk to that man, but okay. Oh, if you can find a light socket that fits those, you want a cookie. I've been everywhere in town. Yeah, try to find a light socket that fits that. Holy shit hard. I thought that'd be like just wander up to Napa, no problem. <laughs> no. Napa dude. Napa dude said bad things about my mother after I spent an hour with that thing on his counter. We'll be back. Today's Captain's Blog is made possible by a grant from Patrick Lovell.